Yo, what's up, y'all? It's Master Ace from Brooklyn, New York. Down with the EMC crew. Album coming soon, the show. And you're checking out Skills TV. So, liebe Leute, willkommen bei Skills TV. Wir haben hier Master Ace exklusiv für euch. Thank you guys for taking time. It's a great honor for me, Master Ace. Appreciate. So the question, the first question, who would interest the most of the viewers is, are you officially back in game? Well, I never really left the game. Um, I know I announced that Long High Summer was my last solo album, but you know that's just what that was—the last solo album. But I plan to do projects like this, like the EMC project, you know, featuring all of the brothers here: Strickland, Punchline, Wordsworth, and other. Projects similar to this, I'm, I'm, I still want to write rhymes and, and be an MC, but I just want to do something different. So this is something different. So is this the main reason why you came back to do something different, different or new? Yeah, I just wanted to add, you know, I just wanted to add a little. I don't know. I was just, I felt like Hot, Long Hot Summer was a good way to kind of finish the solo album career. But I still feel like there's other musical contributions that I want to make with different producers, collaboration projects, things like that. So kind of EMC is the perfect way to kind of set this off is with this group project right here. If you compare your success in the States and in Europe or Germany, what do you realize if you compare the, both communities and the success you had? Well, I realized that um, in the States, You know, there, there kind of seems to be a limit to what your career can be to a certain extent. And um, in Europe, you can keep going. You know, um, Europe really gave me a new, a new outlook on just music in general. Because back in 98, you know, I decided I wasn't doing any more albums. And then came over here to do a tour and got so much love from the fans and the people that still wanted to hear me do music that that get, got me going again and made me want to go back in the studio and do more albums so I came back with Disposable Art so to a certain extent you know fans in the states once you've kind of had your run of whatever many years and they feel like you know they're cool with you they move on to the next person but in Europe they keep they keep showing love to the artists that have been there and have been doing it consistently and so that's why we keep coming back um so you told you came back because you want to start a new projects and you're now here with the group EMC can you just all introduce yourself what up y'all Wordsworth what's going on yeah how y'all doing my name's Strickland from Milwaukee USA what up punchline right here LES Low East Side New York um, will EMC still exist after the album Or uh, it's just a, how should I say, short group to see what happens. You, you know what I'm saying? That's a good question. Um, certainly after this album comes out and does whatever it's going to do, um, all three of these brothers are going to start working on their solo projects and they're going to put out their solo projects. And, you know, by the time we do three solo albums and those all come out and they tour with that, you know, it could be three years might go by. And then maybe it's time again to do another EMC album at that point. Um, we'll see how it goes, though. You know, this thing might take on a life of its own. We don't know. But everybody here wants to definitely do solo records, for sure. Except me. <laughs> um, can you guys maybe say something about your solo projects? Uh, my solo project is just, just in its infant stages, just picking beats right now. Uh, I got a couple... Two, three songs maybe done but it's really in the in this in this infant stages going through beats finding producers um, trying to find out the direction that I want to go I'm learning every day what the fans like so you know I'm on my space and uh, reading what the fans write to me and seeing what they want to hear and trying to cater my stuff to to what my fans actually want to hear I want sweat I don't want to stray away too far from that so <clears throat> just getting started actually on mine Yeah, it's, uh, it'll be my second solo. I'm just like, same thing, looking, you know, for some beats and thinking about what I did the first time out and uh, what I liked about doing that and where, where to improve at or what I want to change. And 
so I'm still in the beginning stages as well. Got some songs recorded that I think would be some definites and just having fun. Um, right now I'm just uh, trying to pick what direction I'm going to go in with the solo album, beats, and uh, what I'm going to call the album right now. So all that's, you know, just thoughts right now. Everything's just in work in progress. So let's talk about the album. It will come soon, we hope. Um, can you say something about the topics or something like about the album? Um, it's about, it's going to be about between 14 and 16 songs. All the songs are recorded. Um, we're in the, in the process of mixing the album right now. It's going to be coming out um, in late March or early April 2007. And um, I'll let my man Punch tell you about the producers. Uh, producers on the album, we got uh, Quincy Tones, Ayatollah, Frequency, um, R, Nicolay, and um, who else am I forgetting? Kool-Aid Marco Polo. And um, that's about it right there as far as producers. Yo, as far as the features, we got Sean Price, we got Little Brother, and uh, we still working on getting some other features and everything, but uh, that's where we at with it right now. We got Adi from Milwaukee. So we got a couple people in there that's going to keep it really exciting and fun. I did a lot of big people working on this album. So I hope you will have the best way of you the best wishes. Um, vielen Dank. Thanks Master Ace. Thanks EMC for all that. Und wenn ihr irgendwas noch von denen hören wollt, es gibt jetzt Four Brothers, könnt ihr im Netz einfach suchen. Der Track heißt Four Brothers. Hört es euch an, wenn es euch gefällt. Ist cool. Und ich bin jetzt draußen. Anything you want to add? I just want to add, um, the group, we out, we out front a lot, but it's a lot of behind the scenes people that don't get a lot of credit. I just want to big up our man, uh, Filthy Rich, he's back in New York, and DJ Rob. They put in a lot of time, a lot of effort, a lot of work to make make sure that um, the group is able to flourish and get out on the road. My man Steve, he holds down the merch, does a lot of things for us. We brought him on the road with us. So it's a lot of people that don't get seen on the camera. <laughs> He's a little under the weather right now because the rooms are mad cold. It's like drafty, but... Um, DJ Rob, Filthy Rich, Steve, Flo Fader, everybody behind the scenes. Just want to big them up real quick. And check the MySpace, EMC The Group. MySpace.com slash EMC The Group. All right? And then you can get in touch with all of us there and everything. All right? I think that's it for us, right? That's it for the EMC, man. EMC.